bill that would legalize recreational marijuana in Rhode Island is now the closest it's ever been to becoming a law. Lawmakers in both the Senate and House committees approved an amended version of the bill today. Now it heads to the floor for a full vote in both chambers. This newest version includes the expungement of past marijuana crimes, and if approved, it would immediately legalize the possession of marijuana. Also important to note, if it becomes law, cities and towns would still vote to or could still vote to opt out of cannabis sales. 12 News reporter Sheena Loshuto was at the State House as lawmakers voted on the bill and has more on what's next in the process. Sheena. Well, Shannon, we spoke to Senator Miller today. He's one of the lead sponsors on this. He says he's really been working on this for about a decade now. Similar bills have moved through the state house before, but it's never gotten this far. That's because this year Miller says they finally have the language right. Abdi? Yes. A bill that would legalize yes. recreational marijuana is now two votes and a signature away from becoming law. We're really uh, well ahead of that progression that we've seen in the past. The legislation now the closest it's ever been to reaching the governor's desk. Both the Senate Judiciary and the House Finance Committee approved an updated version of the bill Wednesday. The updates include changing the new Cannabis Control Commission and how members are appointed. And as it's written now, Governor Dan McKee has already said he'd sign it. I believe that our, our legal department has uh, worked with their legal department. The amended version also calls for the expungement of past marijuana crimes. It also pushes back the possible sales in stores from October to December. It's a good day to be a cultivator. <laughs> Armin Lucy, president of the Rhode Island Cultivator Industry Association, says the biggest takeaway here is people would no longer have to go to Massachusetts, where recreational marijuana is already legal, to buy it, keeping the revenue at home. Hopefully December 1, the recreational stores will open. It will help the cultivators tremendously. At least one lawmaker raised questions about how things like driving under the influence of marijuana would be enforced. Senator Raptakis was the only person to vote against the bill on his Committee. Where in the bill are the penalty phases? What this bill does is it creates resources, it creates revenue that can go towards um, law enforcement to fully enforce what exists on the books currently. Now, lawmakers are expected to take a full vote on this on Tuesday. Now, historically, on big votes like this, we typically see hours of discussion on the House and Senate floors. And it is important to note lawmakers could vote to change this bill even further on Tuesday as well. For now, we're live in Providence. I'm Sheena Loshudo, 12 News.